Hi, what's up, YouTube? I um found these questions on Tumblr that seemed a little interesting. There's 50 of them. And I'm going to answer for you guys because they seem like cool as interesting questions to answer. So, I mean, might as well. All right. Yes. Okay. Number one. What eye color do you find sexiest? Mm. I like green eyes. Green eyes are sexy. Green. Definitely. Number two. White milk or dark chocolate mocha? I don't like dark chocolate, period. Milk chocolate is alright, but I prefer white chocolate over everything because it's sweeter. So, probably white mocha. Number three. If you could get a Sharpie tattoo on your back, what would it be? That's a good question. Um, It's Sharpie, so it's going to come off. Probably get a Sagittarius or Sagittarius symbol. Something about Sagittarius across my back. Number four. Did you grow up in a small or big town? Did you like it? Um... I grew up between California and Kentucky. When I lived in California, I lived in Oakland. It's not really a big town, it's the hood. And when I lived in Kentucky, I grew up in a fairly small town. I mean, it's all right. I live in a small town now, so it's all right, I guess. Five, your favorite adult as a child. My favorite adult as a child is my favorite adult as I am now. My aunt, my mom's sister. She's my favorite. Oh, and for the record, just in case everyone's like, oh, you didn't choose your mom. It says, and not your parents, if they were your favorite. That's why I didn't choose either of my parents. Six, what kind of smoothie sounds really good right now? Strawberry mango. Sounds real good right now. Seven, most embarrassing moment from your elementary school years. I've blocked, for certain reasons, I've blocked uh, elementary school out of my head, so I can't really give you any. Eight, most embarrassing moment from your middle school years. Um, probably, I had this friend. I don't know if she's ever going to see this video, but I'm going to put her name out there. Her name was Melissa. We're cool now, but she's my best friend in middle school. And we had got into a fight, and I upset her. And this is before I liked girls. I didn't realize that my feelings for her were more than a friend at the time. Because I was straight and didn't understand that I had feelings for girls, or I didn't understand my liking for girls. But anyway. I wrote her like this, this fucking 11 page letter like it's like it's like a letter you write to somebody when they're breaking up with you like begging them not to leave it was like one of those types of things and she passed it around school and a rumor went around that I was gay that I was a lesbian and then the letter got to the principal because somebody said I said I was gonna kill somebody so I got suspended I had to go meet with the principal or whatever and I went to meet with the principal and she had a copy of the letter and she let my parents read that <laughs> that was pretty embarrassing number nine most embarrassing moment from your high school years I cannot believe I'm about to say this in a video that I mean fucking people can watch okay if you don't know this normally my hair it's not on mine. It's it's not on mine. I was in high school. Got into a fight my freshman year with a girl by the name of Elisha. Fought in the bathroom. And my weave or whatever at the time came out while we were fighting. Not because she pulled on her or nothing. It came out on its own. I know why it came out. We're not going to go into all those details because I'm not going to tell you what type of weave it was or anything. But yeah, it came out. <laughs> Number 10. <laughs> Pirates or ninjas? Ninjas, because ninjas were black. Oh, I don't know. Uh, ninjas. This is why, but I guess because they were black. I like black. Have you, 11, have you ever climbed a tree more than 20 feet off the ground? No, I've never climbed a tree. I don't like hikes. Mm -mm. 12, did you like swinging as a child? Do you still ex get excited when you see a swing set? When I was a child, I was afraid of the swing. And... Uh -uh. Because my dad pushed me too far off the swing. He pushed me uh, too high or some shit and I fell and hurt myself. So as a kid, I was kind of scared. I get excited now when I see a swing set. I, I overcame my fear as I got older. And now when I go to the park, the only reason I go to the park is to swing. So, <laughs> yeah. 13. If you could have any pet in the world, illegal or not, what would you get? A koala. They're my favorite animal. They're so cute and cuddly, so I'd probably get a koala. Um, 
scrolling down, scroll, scroll, scroll. What's your most favorite part of your body? Um, if I had to choose one body part, my lips. It used to be my stomach because my stomach was really good, but I haven't been working out the slacking off my lips. What's your most favorite part of your personality? 15. Um, my favorite part of my personality, my goofiness, like, I'm a real... Actually, I lied. It's not my goofiness. It's my smoothness. I'm really smooth and slick. Like, I'm, I'm smooth as fuck. And it's my favorite part of my personality. Because it's hard to play me because I'm smooth. Because I'll probably play you before you get... If I sense that you're playing me, I'll play you first. I'm smooth like that. Not saying I'm a player or nothing. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying if you try to play me, I will probably play you first. Um, 16. Madonna or Lady Gaga. Neither, both, or who cares? Who cares? 17. Have you ever watched the Super Bowl all the way through? Heck yeah, I love football. Every year I watch it all the way through. Well, I think. For the most part, yeah. I normally just watch for the halftime show. Okay, wait. This all depends on if there's a team I like. I Every year I watch it all the way through, but as for being interested in it, Eh, not really. But, um, I normally just watch the halftime show. Beyonce is performing at halftime this year, so, hey, that should be interesting. 18, have you ever watched any major sporting event drunk? I don't drink like that, so no. 19, what's the most delicious food you've ever eaten in your life? Damn, that's a hard one. Um, ceviche? I don't know if I pronounced that right, so if you're of Latin descent and I pronounced that wrong, let me know. Ceviche probably the most delicious food I've ever eaten in my life. 20. Margarine or butter, which one did you grow up with? Butter. I grew up with butter. Um, 21. Whole skim 1% or 2% milk. Did you know that they make 1.5% milk? We drink 2% milk here. I did not know they made 1.5% milk. See, you learn something new every day. Um... Which continents have I been on? Or oh, which continents have you been on? North America? What continents have you guys been on? <laughs> um, 23, do you get motion sickness? Any horror stories? Um, no, I don't really get motion sick. My sister got motion, got car sick when we were, um, we were coming back. We had been, we had went to, from Oakland to, Arizona to Arizona to Vegas to Vegas to LA and back to the Bay Area um for a way years ago for family road trip with my dad's side of the family yeah and my middle sister she got car sick and threw up and I don't remember what she threw up in but yeah she got sick so that's kind of a horror story because I think she threw up in something that was mine it was my bag or something that she threw up in backpacks or satchels um backpacks I don't even know what the fuck a satchel is 25, will you wear a rainbow jacket, a neon sweater, yellow, or, oh wait, hold on, I messed that up, my bad. 25, would you wear a rainbow jacket, a neon yellow sweater, or check your pants? I would wear a rainbow jacket. Gay pride, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I would wear a neon yellow sweater, and yeah, I'd wear check your pants. Eh, scrolling. 26, what was your favorite cartoon growing up? Static Shock. I don't know how many of you remember that cartoon, but Static Shock, that was that nigga. He was that nigga back then, so yeah. Um, If you had to have a cow or a pig, what would you take? Why? Cow, because <laughs> it's going to sound horrible, but honestly, a cow, because I'd probably kill it and make something out of it, make some food, because I don't eat pork, so I'd probably take a cow. Give me some milk and some meat. Yep. 28, if you had to look at one city skyline for the rest of your life, which would it be? the bay area because i'm from the bay all day 29 longest plane ride you've ever been on flying from kentucky to california california to kentucky kentucky to back and forth that's about four hours i think i believe four hours six hours something around that so that was the longest flight i've ever taken um the late number 30 the latest you've ever slept um Two, three in the afternoon, maybe. Normally when I'm sick or whatever. 
21, would you buy a sweater covered in kitten pictures? Would you wear it if someone gave it to you for free? Um, probably not. That just sounds ugly, so no. 32, do you pick its scabs? Anybody that lives with me hates this about me, but I pick my pimples and my scabs, and it's not a good habit. It's something I do. I, yeah, I do. Favorite kind of bean? Kidney, black, pinto. Black. That's really all we eat in my house. We eat red beans, white beans, navy beans. But we eat black beans the most, so black beans. 34, how far can you throw a baseball? I don't know. You want to give me a baseball and let me throw it? <laughs> I've never thrown a baseball, so I don't know. 35, if you had to move to another country, where would you move? Um, country? I don't know. That's a good question. I really have no idea. I like America, unfortunately. I like America because it's my comfort zone. I don't like change, so. Um, have you ever eaten Ethiopian food, Vietnamese, Korean, Neapolese? How was it? I haven't had any of them, so I really can't tell you how it was. Small, 37. Small, liberal, art school, or public university? Why? Public university. More. Different types of people. I like different types of people. I like Latinos, Blacks, Whites. Public universities seems like I have more diversity. 38. A relationship with love or one with, with, with sex? <laughs> love. I'm a virgin, so I've never had sex, so I can't really speak on something I've never had. Well, I mean, I can, but I prefer love anyway. Um, 39. Do you eat enough vegetables? Yep. We eat vegetables with every meal around here. It's very rare if we don't, so yes, I get vegetables every night. 40, do you like horror movies? How about thrillers? Love them. Don't want to watch them by myself, but I love them. 41, would you scratch a crotch itch in public? Um, depends on how bad it was itching. I mean, gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. Uh, scrolling. Do you swear in front of your parents? Uh, hell no. No, um, no I don't, because, my bad. No, I don't, because I get my ass beat. I mean, I'm of legal age to swear, but I know my parents know that I swear, but I don't do it in front of them, and I try not to do it in front of my sisters, but I'm not really good at that. I'm going to work on that. Coolest thing you've ever been for Halloween? Myself? I don't dress up for Halloween. 44, if you could change your natural hair color, what would you? Would you to what? Yeah, red, maybe. Red, maybe lighter brown? My hair's not black. I know it looks like it's black. My hair is a very, very dark brown. I'd probably change it to red or light brown. 45, do you want to get married and have kids? Yep. I love to get married and have kids. I want a boy. I want Actually, I want two boys. But if I have a little girl, I'm okay with that too. But I love little boys. 46, do you use a reusable water bottle? If not, you should. Um, I don't know if this counts as reusable, but I refill. I love this song, by the way. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but hold on. And anyway, um. I don't know if this counts as reusable, but, um, I reuse this water bottle, so, well, I only reuse this because we don't have any new water bottles. When we run out of water bottles in the house, I take the, I find one, because, honestly, I have water bottles, empty water bottles all over my floor. So, when we run out of water bottles, I normally take the last one that I use and, um, Put water in it and keep using it until we get more. City or nature person? I'm a city person, I guess. I like the city. Have you ever used something other than makeup as makeup, like paint or markers? No, I don't wear makeup, so I would never have to do that. I, the most makeup I've ever worn is mascara, and I've always used mascara for mascara. 49. Can you walk well in heels? No. Cannot walk in heels at all. 
should have seen me at my graduation trying to walk across that grass and those hills. I should have just worn flats and stopped trying to be cute and go all out for my senior class to see me girly for once. No, I should have wore flats. I looked a hot ass mess. <laughs> um, five awesome things about yourself. Brag away. I'm a sweetheart. Um, I can make people laugh. This is harder than I thought. I'm not really a cocky person that brags on myself, so it's actually hard when I get a chance to. Um, need three more things, guys. Help me out. <laughs> um, I can play defense and basketball pretty well. My post moves in basketball are pretty well, and... Number five, I'm a very loving person. No matter what you do to me, I will. If I love you, I will stop. I will drop everything and do it for you. So, that was those 50 questions. I don't know how many of you are going to watch this because this video is like almost 17 minutes long. So, I'm going to cut this. I asked for you guys to send me in questions. Um, I don't know if anybody did. I'll check now. And if you did, I'll make another video. I'm out. Peace.